What's up guys, it's Tommy here. Welcome back to the channel. In this video, I wanna share with you guys the best new feature in iOS 13 beta 3. I'm honestly shocked that this feature hasn't gotten more attention as this is probably the biggest new feature in beta 3. And the feature that I'm talking about is FaceTime attention correction. If you've ever FaceTimed someone, you've probably noticed that you either look at yourself or you look at them on your screen and you never look directly in the camera. So when you do that, you're not making eye contact with them. And when they're looking at their own screen, they can see your eyes looking down a bit. Well, this new feature prevents that from happening and makes it look like you're making eye contact with them even though you're not. You will need a 2018 iPhone to enable this feature, which means you'll need an iPhone iPhone 10R, 10S, or 10S Max. If you do have one of those devices and you are on beta 3 and want to enable this feature, all you have to do is go to settings. From settings, scroll down until you see FaceTime and then you'll see it on the bottom of your screen. And the description that Apple gives you is, your eye contact with the camera will be more accurate during FaceTime video calls. I did record an example video to show you guys how it works, but before that, I do want to give a shout out to Dave Shukin on Twitter. He did make an example video before, and mine is similar to this one. What he says is, it simply uses AR kit to grab a depth map slash position of your face and adjusts the eyes accordingly. And then also says, notice the wrapping of the line across both eyes and nose. So I'll show you guys my video of that right now as well. You'll notice that in my video, you can see something very similar happening. I also use my glasses just as Dave does in his video to show the warping effect. In the video, you can see that I do pass the frame of my glasses quite a few times just so that you guys can really see the effect it has on them. And by the way, throughout the entire recording of this video example, I am looking at the top right corner of the screen to make sure that I am passing passing the frame of my glasses to the correct part of my face. Does it look like I'm making direct eye contact with the camera? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. But that basically sums up that video example. Overall, I'd say that this feature is pretty amazing and I can't wait for it to be perfected. This is a feature I never expected to see, but I am quite impressed by it. But having said that, if you enjoyed the video, please smash the like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.